power plant. Turbine powered auxiliary power units. What is the function of an APU on modern transport category aircraft? To supply ground electrical and pneumatic power to aircraft systems when the engines are not operating and in some aircraft as a backup source of in-flight electrical power. Of what does a typical APU consist of? A small turbine power plant with provisions for supplying bleed air and an electrical generator that is usually identical to those mounted on the aircraft engines. What usually places the greatest demand on a gas turbine APU? Bleed air loads. What is typically used to start an APU? Its own electric starter and battery power. What is the usual source of a gas turbine APU's fuel supply? One of the aircraft's main fuel tanks. At what speed does a gas turbine APU operate? An APU operates at or near its rated speed regardless of the electrical or pneumatic loads imposed. How is a heavily loaded APU approaching its maximum exhaust gas temperature prevented from overheating? By the use of a load control valve that modulates the pneumatic load to maintain a safe operating temperature. How is the cool down for many APUs accomplished prior to shutdown? By running the APU for a specified minimum period of time after closing the bleed air valve. What is the operating effect of following a required cool down period prior to APU shutdown? The APU's EGT is lowered and stabilized. How is an APU's operating speed maintained despite variations in the loads imposed? By the APU's fuel control automatically adjusting the fuel flow. Name at least two uses for APU produced pneumatic power. Engine starting, ground air conditioning, anti-icing. What type of operating practice could cause thermal shock and possible damage to an APU? Abrupt shutdown of the APU when it is heavily loaded. What powers the variable inlet guide vanes used on some APUs to regulate compressor intake airflow? Fuel pressure. How long is a typical APU cool down period? Three minutes.